The next one is why are there no giant human skeletons found? 下一条问题就系点解冇发现巨型嘅人类骸骨咧 ？I think I know why the person asks about this. 我谂我知道点解呢个人问呢个问题。Because they say that the Bible talks about the Nephilim. 因为佢哋话圣经有提过 Nephilim。And one of the English Bibles translates that as giants. 其中一个英文译本译成巨人。There is actually no reason to expect to find twenty-foot skeletons. 啊啊啊！其实咧，我 six six meter skeleton. 其实冇理由会发现到高六米嘅人类骸骨。Because in any case, you could not have descendants of Adam that were six meters tall. 因为喺任何情况下。你都冇可能有一个亚当嘅后裔系六米高。That's because of what's called the scale problem。因为我哋会话呢一个系比例嘅问题。You can't just take a person and expand the person in all dimensions。你唔可以就咁拎一个人，将佢嘅长阔高加大。That's because if you triple the volume, the the average dimension of a person in all directions。因为当你将一个正常人嘅长阔高加大，而令到佢嘅体积大咗三倍 ，their volume and therefore their weight will increase nine times、oh,。Sorry, sorry, twenty-seven times。佢嘅重量就会重咗二十七倍。But the area of cross-section of their bones, their leg bones, would only increase nine times。但系脚骨嘅横切面嘅面积只系会增加九倍。Which means you would have to massively redesign their legs to be able to support their body. 即系话我哋要完全咁设计过佢对脚，先至可以爱嚟支撑佢嘅身体。And all sorts of other redesign. 仲有好多部分都要重新设计。Which would mean completely new DNA coding. 即系话要有全新嘅遗传基因嘅排列。The limit of human size is probably about three meters or less. 人类嘅高度可能系限制喺三米或以下。Which is probably the height of the giant Goliath described in the Bible。即系圣经所讲哥利亚咁高。And there are some people that tall in the world today。而家世上都有啲咁高嘅人噶。The word Nephilim actually means the fallen ones。其实 Nephilim 呢个字嘅意思系解堕落嘅人。So any giants described in the Bible。所以聖經提到嘅巨人 ，would not be expected to be some you know freak size bones found in the fossil record。你唔好預計會揾到一啲勁大嘅人骨化石